afternoon, children. It's Friday and it's a Friday where Jordan and I actually have nothing to do because he's not booked for any shows. So we're headed to Brooklyn to go hang out with our friends and uh, Champ's Diner, which is a vegan diner in, I guess, kind of like williamsburg -y. I don't really like it that much, but it's closing and my friends are obsessed with it. So they're like, one last hurrah. So we're gonna go to the overpriced vegan diner in Brooklyn. Like as if that couldn't be the least New York thing you could possibly do. Let's get at her. Change of plans. Our friends bailed. And that's fine. I have Jordan still. <laughs> actually, just went to his office. Uh, he needed to pick something up. He actually no. It's not that he needed to pick something up. He had forgotten a lunchbox that I sent him to work with the other day. And it's my lunchbox, and it's so cute, and it's so like, oh, uh, it's like a reusable, cutesy little thing. And on Fridays they throw out everything. Throw everything in the fridge. Well, you know, because they can't just keep like moldy food and stuff. Yeah, it's gross. So he was like, oh, I need to go get something at work. I left something. I was like, whoa, it must be important that we're actually like randomly driving to work on a day you don't need to go in an office. It was my lunchbox. <laughs> <laughs> we're just like walking around and shit now, but uh, trying to figure out not what to do. I mean, it's actually not so cold out, so it's not really a big deal, but I definitely would like to have a pair of earmuffs. But I do think it's very kind of me that the most important thing that I needed to go get from somewhere that I normally wouldn't go would be a personal item of yours. Yeah, because I made you lunch. I'm just saying, I think it's kind <laughs> that I wanted to run back and get it. Gaslighter. I'm back home. I'm gonna turn on, what are we gonna turn on? Our show? Oh, you're trying to get unchanged. And I'm going to binge watch the shit out of this show for the rest of the night. So I guess I will see you guys tomorrow. And Jordan's been looking for, not looking for thrifting, but he always is like, oh, I want a new pair of white Converse. I want white Converse. But they're so expensive. They're like fucking $70. I just found them thrifting for 20 and they're exact size. It's gonna wash them up. And then recently I had to throw out my schoolgirl goth skirt. I had like a, a pass on me from a concert and I forgot to take the pass off before I put it in the wash. And then it got all like gross and sticky and you like couldn't get the shits off so i got this for three dollars just now i'm gonna leave these in the trunk because i gotta wash them yeah <laughs> that was great i don't think that any of you guys are ready for the thrift haul extravaganza that we're about to give you or at least Honestly, I guess I should say that Jordan's about to give you. I didn't even vlog when I was just in the thrift store. We came to Jersey to thrift. All right, so the thrift store in Jersey, I got this skirt for $1. It is a slip and it's a little bit see-through, but I love it because it's lace and it's pretty and I feel like I could wear it with like crop tops and beautiful things and just kind of make a nice outfit. But the real kicker was this neck deep UK pop punk since 2012 crew neck. I remember this circulating on Tumblr and I got it for a mere $6.49. It's in a size small. I couldn't believe that I found it. Well, actually Jordan found it, but I know that the thrift pop punk gods were looking out for me with this one. Aside from pop punk gods, we did also find a Dance Gavin Dance shirt for $7.49. Last time we found a Dance Gavin Dance shirt for $2.50, but I'm willing to pay the extra surcharge. We also just found this plain shirt. This was $1.49, I think, but it was nice. It's from Uniqlo and Jordan will wear it. We found a Tesseract shirt. It was $2.99. I actually didn't know who this band was. I'm assuming they're like very metal, uh, but Jordan, when I pulled it up and said, hey, is this anyone? He goes, oh my God. <laughs> so that was a score for him. This green shirt is for Jordan. It's just a regular tee. It was on sale and we, I believe we got it for $1.99. Basically every t-shirt was under three bucks minus some of the band ones, including the Taylor Swift Reputation Tour. We snagged this for $6 and 49 cents and I can't really complain that it was double the price of all the rest of the shirts because it is a Taylor Swift shirt and Jordan can wear it for work especially when he does the best night ever parties Taylor Swift edition. <laughs> now there's a lot more finds where that came from so make sure you're subscribed and sticking around for the rest of the video where we'll continue our thrift haul shenanigans.
guys. Happy Sunday. We haven't really said what's up, but we've been thrifting all day. All and I day? All day! And I don't... We're just walking back to the car now. We've been walking around all fucking day. Um, it's kind of gorgeous out. We needed a walk. Yeah. We don't walk anymore. We needed a nice moment. Now it's like sunset. That just scared me, the like flutter, <laughs> the fluttering of the, I was like, is that a fucking rat on the side of the bus? And we bought a bunch of stuff, so more things to incorporate in the haul, to be very honest with you. So if you're not subscribed, you better subscribe because <laughs> sometimes we just have like shopping weekends and this weekend was like a fun running around weekend because we didn't have any shows and Jordan didn't really like have work shows. So it was fun oh, to yeah. gallivant and do like an old school kind of vlog again. As you might have saw in the beginning of the video, this was the first thrift haul that really kickstarted the weekend thrifted finds. These Converse were $24.99 and as they were the most expensive of the bunch, they did lead me to this skirt, which was $3. I feel like I showed you a little bit of it in the beginning, but don't worry, we have a lot more where that came from. With this next find was $11.99, these beautiful golden bronze heels. I thought they were so cute. I feel like they look very Victorian goth whimsy i don't even know not really goth but like you kind of get the vibe that i'm going for that really witchy eclectic kind of silhouette and of course i paired these pointy heels with pink ones that are also pointy and these were 9.99 i found these all the way at the bottom of one of the racks and i just thought they were so cute and i actually had on a pair of baggy jeans so i tried them on with it they both were perfectly my size and the heels looked really cute with dark black jeans so i think i'm going to be wearing both of them with that jordan also lucked out on a pair of shoes exactly his size well actually i think these were a little bit bigger these are a size 12 but they were 9.99 so i told him you could just throw in a pair of insoles clean them off and wear them i felt like they were really rock star cowboy and I don't know I just we loved them moving on to the final thrift store find I found a mindless self-indulgent shirt they were like a really sceny weeny band and I couldn't believe that I found it this was eight dollars probably for the sake of no one really knows who this band is obviously the band shirt probably should have been cheaper but I was in Brooklyn so this specific shirt was a little bit heightened in price but I was so excited to have it all right, so that was a really fun thrift haul, vlog, weekend extravaganza. I'm so happy that I was able to spend it with you guys and you guys were able to spend it with me. It makes me really happy to know that we could spend every single Wednesday together. Uh, I have been uploading on Wednesdays specifically, not on Sundays anymore. I just feel like it's been working for the both of us really, really well. And please let me know what you think about that in the comments. What was your favorite thrift store find that I actually found? Uh, with that being said, I hope that you are subscribed or if you are not yet subscribed, you will go ahead and do so. And I'll see See you guys in my next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye!